or have any limits or be uh, unavailable at any point. Um, uh, my mother-in-law, Arlene, with her uh, unmatched sophistication and elegance, has taught me so many things, <clears throat> many of them about lace doilies and things like that. <laughs> Silver, some of the finer things. <laughs> But I'm happy to learn them. And uh, JT the big man, I mean, if there's no better example of unadulterated love and nurturing with a few F-bombs peppered in there. F-bombs, huh? Let me tell you how this works. <laughs> um, I can't thank you enough for not only this night, but a much more cosmic occurrence, which is uh, the meeting of my wife. <laughs> and you guys, um, you're such great parents, you show such great judgment. I'm not sure about the one choice you made to let your 16-year-old daughter date that 20-something kind of here. At the same time, I think it all worked out. I can't thank you enough. I can't tell you how happy I am to, to, to be part of your family and to have you as part of our family. Uh, I'll speak on behalf of my parents when, uh, when I say that uh, you know, you're... You're one of your Smith now as well as wow. the time. So, yeah. it's a tough that's day. a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't come lightly. Here, here. Yeah. <laughs> Couple initiations. Yeah. No. But um, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'd also like to thank my folks, my mother, the ninja mom, as they say, the mother whose uh, prowess in the family realm is, is unrivaled. When I, she, she's the one who taught me about accountability, about taking care of your family. When I was uh, disinvited back to boarding school after a, a chance occurrence that was completely out of my control. My mother said, uh, I came home, I came home and, and, uh, and I was really shaking in my boots about what I was going to face. You know, it's like, what are my parents going to say? And the first thing my mother did was, uh, told me I had to sit down and write a letter to all of my grandparents telling them how I had let them down and I would never, ever do that again. And you know what? That told me something about, you know, life isn't just about you. You know, you got your whole family around you, you got the whole community looking after you, and you gotta, you need to pay heed and pay respect. And I, I think that that speaks a lot to, uh, what I said, character and accountability, and that was my mother. And then my father, I'm not even sure where he was at that time. No, I'm just kidding. Dad, your latte-infused sense of humor may at times be fragmented. But when the conversation turns to uh, moral questions, questions of, uh, of character, of honesty, I think you're one of the most articulate people I've ever I've ever come in contact with. So I thank you for teaching me how to be a gentleman, uh, for what I know, and, and uh, can't thank you enough. And I think there's just one other person. Oh, hi. <laughs> what are you doing there? <laughs> Bride has taught me so much, not only through the last uh, six or seven months of this planning process, <laughs> but over the last ten years. And I know what a lot of you are thinking. I know you're thinking we're rushing into this, and maybe we don't really know. Each other. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, it was about year nine that I was like, hmm. <laughs> Maybe we should put a contract. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
so my darling wife, my darling wife has uh, brought a quietness to a uh, part of me that was once restless, has brought a, a, a calmness to, uh, to my life that, um, that I've, I've never encountered before. And uh, as I, I was standing there in the church thinking about uh, these sort of rites of passage and, and how this is uh, kind of blowing my mind, I was, I, I was picturing myself at, at so many different times in my life. I've been at sort of a block, a sort of a wall, a door, and she's helped me open it. She found, she's found the key for me. Sometimes it was in my pocket, but... <laughs> <laughs> she sort of helped me walk through the door and, and, and sees so many opportunities to be a better person in all the relationships in my life, to be a better boyfriend and now husband. Um, she never stopped teaching me. And um, even sometimes I don't want to learn. <laughs> <laughs> five or six years of not wanting to learn. Really. But uh, you know, when I when I have no ideas and I'm and I'm sitting there and I'm facing an issue and I just and I don't have and I'm at a loss, uh, she gives me ideas. And when I have a decent idea, she makes that decent idea a great idea. Wow. And uh, whether or not saying yes to my proposal was a great idea. It <laughs> remains to be seen. But uh, I'm going to do everything in my power to make sure that it was. Aww. And I love you. Aww. Aww. Aww.